In this video, I'm going to cover five Excel hacks that you might know, but if you don't, should know, uh, efficiency tricks in Excel. That made sense in my head. Essentially, these five tricks are commonly used things that you might be doing in Excel, and you're probably better doing it this way that I'm going to show you in this video. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start. The first hack is how to rearrange your columns. You're probably selecting your column, inserting a new one, copying the data over, and then pasting it there. There's a much more efficient way where you can do this, where you just select your column, select control, and then drag that into the position that you want. So much faster, and it saves you a bunch of clicks. The next tip is when you want to sort and filter your data. There's an easier way to do this, not having to select your, your header column and then selecting sort and then selecting what you want to search. You can just right click inside your table, pick one of the fields, right click, go to filter and select uh, the values. That will automatically bring in your uh, sort orders and your filter headers. And then you can just from there do what you need to do. The next trick is not having to write sum when you want to do a row or column total. So what you might be doing is writing equals sum. You might be selecting your range and then getting your result. What you can do is hold alt equals and that will just auto sum everything in the column above. If you're doing it at a row level, you can once again alt equals and it will give you the sum of that column of that row. Sorry. If you need to move your tables without having to actually scroll down to the bottom or scroll up, you can just hold control and the arrow key and it will take you to the end of where the data is. So if I hold control and then right arrow key, it will take me to the end of my table on the right hand side. If I hold control down, it will take me to the bottom. And if we hold control shift, it will actually highlight and select the data as well. So if we want to copy and paste a particular column, we can just hold control shift. You don't even have to touch your mouse just to navigate your table. So the next trick is to do with adding uh, columns or rows. We tend to insert columns and rows as we need to add more data, but there's a more efficient way to do this than selecting your column, right clicking and then selecting insert. What we can do is select our column for now and just hold control shift plus and that will insert a new column. If we select a row, it will do the same thing. We can be a little bit more efficient with this where we just select our column, hold control shift plus and then we'll add a new column. That's all I have for this video. I kept it really basic, but these are some fundamentals that I use all the time that are just really efficient. So I thought I'll share that for my first Excel video. So if you like that, feel free to like and subscribe. It helps the channel and for more Power BI, Excel and SQL content.